A bombshell study released last week shows those previously infected with SARS-CoV-2 have natural immunity that offers 13 times more protection against the Delta variant than vaccination alone. The findings are from Tel Aviv. They followed over 700,000 people that were broken up into three different groups. Those who were vaccinated with two doses of Pfizer, those who had recovered from a previous infection, and those who had recovered and received only one dose of the Pfizer vaccine. Now, the study found that those who had recovered from COVID were 13 times less likely to end up reinfected, concluding that natural immunity confers longer lasting and stronger protection against infection, symptomatic disease, and hospitalization. Now, though the researchers did see some increased benefit for those previously infected who also received one dose of the Pfizer vaccine, the researchers concluded the difference was statistically insignificant. So why would those who have natural immunity have a more robust immune response? The researchers hypothesized that it's because of B and T cell memory and the fact people who recovered from the virus are exposed to the entire virus, not just the spike protein the vaccines expose the body to. The study is yet to be peer-reviewed, but the findings are consistent with other studies and public health data. In July, the Israeli Health Ministry released data showing that of the nearly 850,000 Israelis known to have recovered from the virus, there were only 72 instances of reinfection, showing those with natural immunity were six and a half times less likely to be affected by the Delta variant than those who were fully vaccinated. In May, the World Health Organization found that the immune systems of more than 95% of people who recovered from COVID-19 had durable memories of the virus that remained fairly stable over time, only declining modestly at six to eight months after infection. Also, six studies, which encompass nearly one million people from Qatar to Denmark to the U.S. Marines, all found that the range of reduction of reinfection from COVID-19 was between 82% to 95% and found that naturally induced immunity resulted in extremely low rates of hospitalization and death in the event of repeat infection. Now, in the beginning, I said this was a bombshell study, but the reality is this shouldn't have been a bombshell at all. Conventional science has always held that previous infection results in robust immunity against reinfection from various viruses. However, for some strange politicized reason, for the past year and a half, this scientific fact has been hotly debated here in the U.S. But it wasn't always. In the instance of chickenpox, the CDC recommends vaccination for those who haven't had a previous infection. On their website, under the heading, Who Needs a Chickenpox Vaccine?, the CDC says, quote, People 13 years of age and older who have never had chickenpox or received chickenpox vaccine should get two doses. At